I wonder why Abby wanted to do modded PND. Stemple B-roll.
Howdy, 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 folks. We are gearing up for PMD. I am turning the music down. And we will transition and say hi to the wonderful cavalcade of voice actors that have joined us today and have volunteered their time and their voice to help my first experience be as magical as possible. Hi, everybody. Hello. Hello, Abby. There's a lot of folks here. Hello. Yep. So, real quick, we'll, we'll just go alphabetically through the list of people who are in this voice call right now. Artemis? Hello, I am Azure Artemis, as you've seen on my Twitch and all that. I stream with Abby a lot, been teaching her Kingdom Hearts, mm -hmm. but here playing the Riolu, and maybe many more. Yeah, uh, they are going to be my partner Pokemon, and be because they might, you know, kind of be my partner in real life. Yeah, that might be a thing. Uh, maybe a little. <laughs> you know, uh, we have Carol. Hello, I'll be trying to voice Zubat, I guess. Yeah. You're going to voice Zubat. Yeah! We have... Oh, ooh, brain, we're off right now. Sorry. Uh, oh, right, Discord's doing the thing where it's hiding everybody's names. Uh, Great. I need to turn off. I'm going to have to turn off mode. streamer mode, so that might be a little weird. Yeah. Uh, Doubt. Howdy, howdy. I am a uh, voicing coughing and dusk more. Ferris. Hello, I I'm Ferris, um, and I'm gonna be voicing Bidoof. Uh, Tank Fax, also known as the Mimikyu that sits on my head a lot of the times. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. I'm gonna be voicing Wigglytuff, uh, Kecleon, and Loudred. Mizu. Hello, I'm Mizu. I'm going to be voicing Zatu and random other voices, uh, potentially. Neo? Neo Buryu here, giving his voice to the narrator because they wanted one with a French accent. Yeah. Reesh? Hello, I'm Reggie, and I will be uh, voicing various French towns folk. Shoal? I am Shoal, and I'll be voicing Chatot. And side effect. Uh, I'm just side. I had planned to be voicing Skuntank and most likely Sunflora because I know nobody's going to want to voice Sunflora. <laughs> yeah. And we're going to get started. So let us begin. This is a modded version of PMD Sky. And you'll see what the mods are very soon. By the way, I think your Discord stream is still showing the title card. Oh, did it not? Oh, it did not change to the right. Okay. Right, it's doing windowed projector on the wrong thing, because, you know, hey. Alright, I'm just going to windowed projector the split even and share that with you guys. That we mm, have multiple fine. scenes for multiple things, in case. Yeah. Let's do a special episode 5. It's pretty much an extension of the plot. I have a lot that I need to do. 
This is my first ever playthrough. I have never completed a mystery dungeon. I have played through the demo of the first mystery dungeon, but on remade on Switch. And I played through super up through like the classroom beginning stuff, and that was it. Um but that is my PMD experience. I have never finished a PMD and I've never played Sky, the the PMD that everyone says to play and is everyone's favorite game. Yeah, I was going to say this is this is peak Pokemon history. Yep. Is it possible to just capture the game cuz it's it's very pixelated on on the stream. Very small. I can anyway. capture the game. Yeah. Very small, yeah. very pixelated. All right, there we go. There we go. Yep. Oh, well, I just... We'll see if sound capture decides it wants to work through. Do you guys hear it now? It's, it's working. Okay. Mm -hmm. And yep, I do ask you guys be gentle with the spoilers. I have no idea what goes on, just the memes that have bled out from this game over the many, many, many years and many, many, many fans that constantly meme on this game. So... Just ask for respect I on that. that. You, you have no idea how many hours on end I've listened to this menu theme. Alright, so we're going to start a new game. Neo. Yep. Oh, I didn't... Welcome. We didn't... Oh. Oh, there we go. Oh. -ho. This is the portal that leads to the world... Inhabited only by Pokemon. Beyond this gateway, many new adventures and fresh experiences await your arrival. Before you depart for adventure, you must answer some questions. Be truthful when you answer them. Now, are you ready? Then, let the questions begin. Did you play Explorers of Time or Explorers of Darkness? No, unfortunately I have not. You've been asked to do a difficult task. What will you do? I'll ask somebody for help. Do you think that no matter what, life goes on? All the time. You're hiking up a mountain when you reach diverging paths. Which kind do you take? Wide. Good news and bad news. Which one do you want to hear first? The bad news. You fail miserably. Everyone found out and they're disappointed in you. What do you do? <sighs> I mean, uh, I would apologize, but that's not an option here. So, try and hide would probably be the next thing. You're daydreaming. When your friend sprays you with water, what do you do? Woohoo! Water fight! Do you think you have good study habits? Uh, no. Do you think it's important to always aim to be the best? Yeah. Are you male or female? Female. And now, your aura will be analyzed. Your aura is the energy that you radiate. Relax, calm yourself. And now, press your fingertip gently on the bow. That's right. Stay perfectly still. Take a deep breath, and now exhale. Your aura, your aura has now been identified. Your aura is... A stately silver. Thank you for answering all those questions. You seem to be the naive type. You're so open and innocent. What a strong sense of curiosity you have. 
and you state your opinions purely, sharing exactly what you think. You also have an, an artistic spirit that isn't restrained by social conventions. You startle people with your spontaneity and vision. But when you overdo it, other people can have a hard time keeping up with you. Have you noticed people looking at you oddly? As if for no apparent reason? So, a naive, innocent type like you will be a skitty. No, I won't. Is skitty what you want? No. Then, who would you like to be? This one. Is Abra who you want? Yeah. And finally, who will be your partner? Choose a Pokemon who you want for a partner. Hi. Is Riolu who you want? Yeah. Artemis, okay? Yes. Okay. That's it. You're all ready to go. You're off to the world of Pokemon. Be strong, stay smart, and be victorious. Chapter 1. A Storm at Sea. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Are, are you okay? Wait, no, is this not me? I don't think this is me. You don't know That's who not... this is. We don't no, know we who don't this know is who yet. Is. Oh. No, don't let go. Just a little longer. Come on, hang on. No, no, no! I, I can't, hold on. Ah! Welcome to the beginning of Skyrim? No. <laughs> ah, you finally woken up, I see. <laughs> you were trying the to cross the border. Same as us, and that thief over there. Uh, where... Where am I? I can't... Drifting off. No. I refuse to be paralyzed by this any longer. This is it. I have to steal my courage today. Pokemon detected. Pokemon detected. Uh, push to talk. Huh? Right. Oh, Pokemon wait. detected. Pokemon detected. Was that our Thomas all the way back? Yeah, yeah, I forgot to was... hit my button. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. Completely <laughs> heard you over at these microphones. <laughs> it was no, no, so loud. It, it, Don't worry it, about it's it. Theme. It's on theme. It's on the distant. Yeah, it's, it's distant. distant. It's so it's that perfect. actually worked out really well. Yeah, that worked out really well. Also, hi, Bryce. Welcome. Thank you. Hi there. Uh, well, Bryce is joining us as well. Do you, do you know who you want to voice act? We have a list in the uh, special PMD voice chat. I do. But the only problem is, I'm not sure I can mention who it is because it's pretty far, it, relatively far. Actually, no, it's not that far in at all. You should be able to, you, you should encounter them. I'm okay. going to send it to you in DMs, uh, Azure. You played this game, right? 
Yeah. Okay, just making sure this... Most isn't... of us have in here. Okay. When you're good, I'm gonna hit the A button. Yep. Throw that in your DMs, make sure it's alright if I can say that. Mm -hmm. I don't think anybody's claimed them yet. And you can say that one. Okay. Anybody has the Take and Grow vial yet? I don't think so. No. Okay. All I'll right. go for that. Artomis, is your face supposed to look like that? I'm shocked. Oh, okay. <laughs> There's a Pokemon detected. Pokemon detected! All right. Uh, Who's Fulprit? Who's Fulprit? Flippert is real loose! <laughs> you alright? I don't know why it Oh, it did a thing? Yeah. As long as you're good. Flippert is real loose! The Flippert is real loose! Ah! <laughs> that was too shocking! <sighs> I can't. I can't work out the courage to go in after all. I told myself that this would be the day, but... I thought that holding on to my personal treasure would inspire me. I just can't do it. I'm such a coward. This is so discouraging. Mm. Hey, Zubat. Did you get... I cannot see. Uh, it. Oh, is it, it not it, showing it properly? Discord's doing that thing where it doesn't properly load everything. Oh, uh, I wonder if oh, I can the stream on the screen. side. I'm going to. Oh, oh no, the bit rate's maxed on the channel. <laughs> this hey, is so that. many people. Can you get a load of that. Yeah. Can you set the Discord to um the the better text readability? Uh, I'm not sure if I can, but I'll see. I don't see anything for that. In my, it um, should be in your stream settings. Yeah. Oh, in Discord my personal stream settings. Stream, settings. stream quality. Oh, yes. uh, uh, I'm trying to see if I can find it. So if you hang up the stream, if you stop streaming through Discord and then go to open it again, there's mm -hmm. quality settings in the wizard. Oh, oh. So if I click on that and then quality, stream better quality, text better text readability. Okay. Oh, that's much better already. Ooh! Okay. Right, Might only yeah, be 15 be FPS on our end, but we can read our lines now. Yeah, okay. cares about the FPS. Okay. Coughing, you want to go again? Yeah. Hey, Zubat, did you get a load of that? You bet I did coughing. That little wimp was pacing around. Had some good, right? They went had something, that's for sure. It looks like some kind of treasure. Come here. Do we go after it? We do. I think I might have set Abra's walk animation to be what Abra's normally is, so that's why it's floating. Uh, here comes the good music. Oh wow, what a pretty sight. When the weather's good, the crabby come out at sundown and blow bubbles. 
All those bubbles catching the setting sun's rays off the waves. It's always beautiful. This is where I always come when I'm feeling sorry for myself. But it makes me feel good to be here, like always. Coming here is un uplifting. It cheers me up. Hey. What's that? What's going on over there? What? Someone's collapsed in the sand, even though they're walking blatantly I'm, on it. I'm stuck in the air! <laughs> Get me down from here! <laughs> what, what happened? Why are you like this? Are you okay? <laughs> You're awake. That's a relief. Where? Where am I? You weren't moving at all. I was seriously worried. Do you remember how you ended up unconscious here? I... I was unconscious? What happened? Well, I'm Artomis. Glad to meet you. And who are you? I've never seen you around here before. What? You say you're a human? You look like a totally normal Abra to me. It... It's true! I've turned into an Abra. But how did this happen? I... I don't remember anything. You're... a little odd. Are you pulling some kind of trick on me? You're telling me the truth? Alright, then your name. What's your name? My name? That's right. My name is... <laughs> Abby! Abby okay? Yeah. I mean, I chose it. Oh, Abby is your name? Okay. Well, you don't seem to be a bad Pokemon, at least. Sorry that I doubted you. More and more, bad Pokemon have been turning up lately, you see. Many Pokemon have gotten aggressive lately. Things have grown somewhat lawless. Ow! Well, I do beg your pardon. Hey, why did you do that? <laughs> Can't you figure it out? We, we want this. We want to mess with you. Can't you space us up? Can you? Hmm? What? That's yours, isn't it? N no, that's. Sorry, kiddo. We'll be taken there. Young. Ah! Whoa, ho, ho! Not gonna make a move to get that back. What's the matter? Too scared? I didn't expect you to be such a big coward. Come on, let's get out of here. See you around, chicken. <laughs> mm. 
Uh, what, what should I do? It's my personal treasure. It means everything to me. If I lose that... Mm, no. There's no time to waste. I've got to get it back. Hey, can I get you to help me? Uh, uh, but, but what should I do? We don't have time to waste, come on! Got it. Really? You'll really help? Thank you! Uh, let's move quickly! Head for the stairway. As you go, you can attack enemies by pressing A. Enemies won't move or act until you do. Hey! Right. I got 24 bucks! P is this world's money. Save it up and buy useful mighty money. Uh, yeah. Save it up and buy useful items for your adventures. Right. We don't have to narrate through here. Anyway, hi. Right, we we hi. can hi. we can kind of uh, relax we a little bit as we go through the freely. beginning dungeon. Yeah. Also, we're joined mm -hmm. by yogurt. Yogurt. Bye, yogurt. yogurt. Hello. <sighs> Just as a tip, if you move in a different position to where I can attack too, that will help you. Ah. You're not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It doesn't you're... do that automatically. Ah. Okay. Hello. Welcome. Unless you set them to be aggressive. I mean, it's, it's nice to see that uh, they ran into the most easiest place imaginable. Buto is not a ghost-type Pokemon. You really I like using I Foresight. Some, can I make some options menu suggestions for you? Sure. Should probably get through this fight. Yeah. Gained 11 XP! Okay, so I believe... Oh. Uh, menu's X. Oh, right. Yeah. EMD. So that darkness thing was just to help you see the map better. If you ah, I see, I see. So if you go to others... Okay. There are a couple of helpful things in options. Mm-hmm. Um... I don't know if you care about the the top screen. Um, you can set the top screen to um, uh, uh, the one that I tend to like is um, map and team. Hmm. And then you can clear off the bottom screen so it doesn't have anything on it. Um, the grids are sometimes helpful. Uh, speed fast will help you play the game faster. Uh, far off pals, um, when you get separated, um, this is a setting that, like, uh, the camera will pan over to them if they're in combat, um, but you'll still see it in the text log. I have, I think if you set it to don't look, it, it makes combat go a little bit faster, especially when you're separated. Um, uh, sorry, self, yeah. Um, uh, damage turn is sometimes annoying and um what that is is if you get hit it will uh turn your your actual facing direction to whoever hit you um sometimes this is irritating in like boss fights and stuff though if you're trying to focus on one thing so whether whether you want that on or off is a personal preference thing but um, yeah like it says you can hold y and move in to face direction again okay yeah. um and then i actually uh, D-pad attack you do not want on, and uh, check direction. I don't remember what that does. Uh, uh, doesn't I... that force some kind of extra button input if you're at like a crossroads or something? No, the uh, cross attack makes it so if you walk into somebody, it will attack automatically, which no, is the terrible. the check direction. Oh, uh, wouldn't like... pressing select give you a little bit of a explanation on that? Or is that in the newer I, PMD? The newer, I'd the newer select one. and do anything, yeah. 
Yeah, no. I don't think... Like, if, if I remember correctly, I think check direction makes it so you have to push a direction twice in order to move past an intersection. Yeah, you might want to leave that off. Okay. Oh, we can change our frames. Save the frames. We'll go with type 1. Map. Oh, that's just literally that. It's just the map. Okay. Team. Right, so... Artomas is summary. Tactic, let's go together. IQ, half a star. He's not very star. smart. Got steadfast and inner focus. Um, Emanation Pokemon. Can does he have any? I I forget what they start with for IQ skills, but uh, we may want to look in there. Uh, Item master, course depth. checker. Exclusive move user, item catcher. Yeah. Um, you will yeah. want to to upgrade the IQ on your uh on your Pokemon because basic AI things like um not using a move that doesn't have any PP is an upgrade you have to buy. Oh, I see. <laughs> if you when... go to the moves category, you can choose what moves they activate. By the way, as well. Oh. So yeah, a half a star of IQ is about as smart as you yeah, expect it's half a star of IQ to be. Okay. <laughs> Which is not very... Alright, yeah, we'll get to my moves in a moment, because I might have modified this just a hair. Just a, just teleport, a smidgen. Teleport isn't exactly, you know, the best starting moves. Uh... But, yeah. You may want to turn off Endure, at least. I don't think that... Personally, I don't think that move is very good in the PMD format. Oh. Uh. You can look at the, the what it does as well. Use the Enduring status. Pokemon with Enduring status will survive any attack or move that would normally make the faint. We'll hang on with 1 HP. Okay. So, like, only useful if we're in, like, a place that's 10 levels above us and you're getting one shot. I mean, it's useful sometimes, oh, but the fine. problem, again, is that the AI is bonkers dumb. So, like, unchecking it means that the AI won't randomly use it instead of a useful move like Quick Attack. Yeah, I feel like I might want to turn off Poor Sight for the time being as well. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. Then for Abby... Tactics meeting. Uh... Check IQ. I believe I have the same IQ as Artomas. Half a star. Yep. I've, uh, rather than using Abra's base stats, I copied over another starter, Vulpix, on top of Abra's stats. Um, yeah. because I know starter Pokemon have much different stat distributions than random basic Pokemon. So, we're kind of pulling from that. Also, and, they're both boxes. Yeah. I am psychic. And they both have terrible defense. I have synchronize, shares status problems with foes in reach, and protects Pokemon from cringing. I've been on the internet more than long enough to know how to avoid cringe. <laughs> Immune to cringe. I wish I could have that. Right. One of the artists in the chat, could you uh, please edit Abby's head onto that one guy who went viral a couple of days ago trying to get caught up in that like debate where it's like you want this or want that and he's like i don't have to answer either or yeah then for moves we have one attacking move confusion i might have had a little fun because most pokemon do have another utility move here so i, I grabbed something that's part of abra's move set but doesn't break things i hope i don't know how attract works in this uh, you'll Inf be fine infatuated But, you know. And of course, teleport. Warps to another tile on the floor. Oh, I just go rando! That'll yeah. be fun! <laughs> fun. And yeah. Kinesis knocks down. You should set confusion as well. There you go. Yep. Yeah. Alright. We have no items. Alright. I should. Honey, the first dollar in our pockets you just picked up. I know. 
Oh, hey, the stairs. The was I feel like I should probably look around a bit more before we head downstairs, though. See if there's anything neat. There might not be anything neat. In in Beach Cave, the the item drop list is pretty much uh, money, money. And, and like the occasional berry. Okay. I need to figure out how to use a set move. Uh, you hold down L and press A. Okay. You can also, um, so map and team is a useful screen, but if you want to just to get used to the game, the default one was controls on the, on the top screen. Okay. Carry one item, these items you find on the floor, a variety of useful effects. Find an item, open the menu with X, and go into the items menu to see what it does. Bro, this white chocolate peanut butter spread is pretty fire. That sounds incredible. That almost doesn't sound real. <laughs> Got it's that nerdy nut uh, brand. An orange berry which restores HP. If you want to use the berry in the menu, press X, then select E. Unlike in the regular series, orange berries are actually legit awesome in this. They are a lifesaver. Bill's yeah. belly. That filling, filling belly is important. Right? What was that? I think they do 100 HP. It's some ridiculous number. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, no, they are really good. It'll take a while before citrus berries actually outpace an orange berry. I think my confusion's yeah, a little wrong. powerful. It may be a smidgen. It's fine. It'll stop being OP eventually. But at the, but at the same time, they kind of have to in the later game. Mm. Yeah. Grew to level 6. My HP went up 2. My defense went up 1. My special defense went up 1. Artomas got 13 XP. But yeah, f filling your belly will be important in longer hull dungeons. In some areas, you'll see a ground title with a green arrow. That's a wonder tile. Step on it to heal any stat changes. Um... One thing that's also important uh, is um, if you want to walk diagonally, which is sometimes incredibly important in this game um, because everybody moves. Uh, uh, yeah, it's the holding that button. I found a blast seed, but unfortunately I can't do anything with it. You can swap it if you want to. Yeah, you only have one inventory slot right now. I need a bag. Sorry, but we didn't give you the bag yet. Ah. Uh, <laughs> wonder if I should eat the bag. When you wake up on the beach, you, can only, you don't have anything on. You don't have the most basic PMDOC accessory in the world. Uh, this I Pokemon can learn. can learn a new move, but must forget an old move first. To relearn an old move, go to the Electivire Link Shot. Oh, counter. wonder what should be on top of... Because counter is foresight. get hit. Yeah, foresight is nearly useless until the end of the game, at which point it becomes useful exactly once. <laughs> Wait, I leveled up! Artomas' HP went up three. Artomas' attack went up two. Artomas' defense went up two. Artomas' special attack went up two. Artomas' special defense went up two. I'm That's your wall. That's a hell of a special attack! A hell of an everything that just got boosted. Alright, well, I guess we could eat the orange berry on the ground and fill our bellies. Fill yours. I, I believe you can eat stuff directly off the ground. Yeah. Uh -huh. Correct. Have any questions or anything? You can check out the quick hint, quick hints, by opening the menu with X and selecting others to find the hints option. Oh yeah, that's like a—they have a whole like in-game manual kind of thing. That's 
nice. It's very extensive, actually, so if you're ever confused about anything... It does have quite a lot of information. There's which also... no kids ever read, ever. Nope. Because kids don't read. Excuse you, I was a kid and I read it. <laughs> uh, ditto. <laughs> oh, plot time. You are wiser two, than most kids. Two uh, kids read it. <laughs> debatable. Hey! Well, well, well. If it isn't our old friend, the big chicken. You're playing a torture at this time. That hurts more. Give me... Give me back what you stole from me! That's my personal treasure! It means everything to me! Treasure, you say? <laughs> so that thing really is valuable, huh? <laughs> it could be worth more than we hoped for, I'd say! We ought to try selling it. Who knows? It might get a good price. Whoa! All the more reason not to give it back! What? You want it back that badly? Come and get it! <laughs> it's a boss fight! You actually get to beat up the bullies for... for once in an actual RPG. Come nice! Violence. Which they deserve. Yeah. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Oh, no, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. wait. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Absolutely oh. vaporized. Ah. We got locked up. B Blast it! How did you get? How did we get wiped out by them? By wimps like them? Bah! Here you go. Take it then. Yeah. Give you up. Whoa! Don't you think? Don't think you're so awesome. Your victory was a fluke. Yeah, you just remember that. Yeah. Oh, it's my relic fragment. Am I ever glad? I actually did manage to get it back. It's only because you agreed to help me, Abby. Thank you, Abby. Yeah. Or love to voice act. I mean, if people want to join us for future sessions, yeah, we can we can get people in further because I'm not sure we have like a ton of people in here now, but I'm not sure everyone's going to be free every Sunday. There's also like 50 characters in this. There's a yeah. Lot. Thank you. Seriously. Ah. Mm. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> turned, into a, turned into a delicious beverage on stream. No wonder why you're silent. Ah! I only helped because I happened to be there. Was that the right thing to do? I guess so. This Pokemon is clearly grateful. It's nice to be appreciated. Here's what they stole. This is a relic fragment. Well, at least that's why I started calling it. I'm speed. I'm a Sonic 2006 OC. Sorry. Give me a moment. <laughs> Alright, I'm back. <laughs> but this relic fragment. It's my precious treasure. You see, I've always liked legends and lore. I always get so excited when I hear tales from the past. Don't you feel the same way, just wide and 
expansive. I feel very wide, actually. Hidden troves full of treasure, strange relics. Uncharted territories veiled in darkness. And new lands just waiting to be dis discovered. Such places must be full of unimaginable gold and treasure. Your eyes are... <laughs> Sparkle- I'm- You're not supposed to bring Pokeballs into PMD. <laughs> That's illegal. In history, it wouldn't be amazing- Wouldn't it be amazing to make historic discoveries? That's what I always dream of. It's all exciting to me. So one day, I happen to come across my relic fragment. I admit that it looks like junk, but take a closer look. See? Huh. That inscription forms a strange pattern, doesn't it? It's true. There is a strange inscription. I've never seen a pattern like this. There must be some significance to this pattern. This relic fragment must be a key to a legendary place. To areas where precious treasure lies. At least that's the feeling I get. That's why I want to join an exploration team. This fragment must fit into something somewhere. I want to discover where that is. I want to solve the mystery of my relic fragment. So earlier, I tried joining an exploration team as an apprentice, but I chickened out. Oh. What about you, Abby? What are you going to do now? You lost your memory. You somehow transformed into a Pokemon. Do you have anywhere to go and stay after this? Uh... If not, can I ask a big favor? Would you be willing to form an exploration team with me? Convinced that I can form an uh, yeah, effective exploration team with you, Abby. Uh, so, will you? Please? Uh, what, what What? should I do? I'm getting recruited out of the blue! I, I don't know what an exploration team is. What should I do? Should I join this Pokemon and form an, explora an exploration team? Or a team. Say no. Are you? Uh, I'm gonna do. Are you? Cause I don't know where that where that goes. Are you? Huh? Am I what? What do you mean? Are you? Are you? You're trying to talk me into it. What? Lock you into it? I didn't even think of it. Well, I'm a complete coward. Honestly. I mean, yes, I thought I could depend on you, Abby. But during that fight with coughing earlier, having you there with me, I felt really brave. I think I could do anything as long as you're helping me, Abby. So... Come on, I'm begging you. Let's form an exploration team. You and me. How could I say no? By pressing down on the D-pad, pressing A. <laughs> <laughs> Let's form a team. It is true, I... do have nowhere to go. I don't have any clue what I should do next. I guess it wouldn't hurt to team up with Artomis for now. 
Maybe I'll eventually discover who or what I am by hanging out with this Pokemon. Okay, it's settled. Yes? Really? You'll form an exploration team with me? Yes! Thank you! We're going to be a great combination. Let's make this work. First, we should head up to Wigglytuff's place and sign up as apprentices. That's where we need to train to become first-rate exploration team. I'm sure the training will be very tough. But let's give it our best, Abby. Alright. Yeah. I don't think God's back yet. Oh, it's all right. Yeah, no, they were going to go get dinner. And so, Artomis and Abby formed an exploration team. This turned out to be their very first step into many fantastic realms of adventure that awaited their arrival. Wow, spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> Rude. It really was an adventure of Sky. I don't drop. Wow. I'm playing the game now. Would you like to save your adventure? Yeah. No. Save no. failed. <laughs> <laughs> Look. <laughs> okay. I might need to like figure out how to set up how saving works in this. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> DS that I found with the ability to, to do things. Don't worry about it, Nintendo. It, it's is a perfectly good DS. Yeah. This is Wigglytuff's Guild. To form an exploration team, you need to register your team here. Then you have to train until you become first-rate exploration team. Uh, yikes. Isn't there something just a little odd about this place? The fire seems a bit excessive, yeah. No. I've got Abby with me this time. At a time. I have to be brave. Even though it's not my nature. Pokemon detected! Pokemon detected! Whose footprint? Whose footprint? The footprint is real, Lou! The, the footprint, footprint is real, Lou! Ah! No! I have to be strong. You may enter! Someone's with you! So get the stranger to stand up there! We'll see how that goes. Uh, <laughs> I mean... They probably meant you, Abby. No. They said to stand up there. Uh. There's a grate covering that hole. It's made so that no one can fall through. Still, it's really strange. It looks like it'll tickle my feet or... Uh. Hey you, stranger! Get on that grate! Pokemon detected! Pokemon detected! Whose footprint? I don't know if this Who's is gonna work. Footprint? I have no idea if this will actually work. The footprint is. Uh, the footprint is. Uh, what's the matter? Sentry! Sentry? What's wrong, Century Diglett? Um, uh, there's a lot of dirt in here. Uh, um, the footprint is maybe Abra's. <laughs> 
I mean, it's pretty astute to get me while I'm floating. Maybe Abra's. What? Maybe. But, but it's not a footprint that you normally see around here. Cause I'm floating. Ah, that's pretty crummy. Checking the footprints is a missing pocket. Pokemon. That's your job, isn't it, Diggly? Y yes but I don't know what I don't know. What? Are they arguing? Sorry to make you wait. Well, it's true that you don't see any Abra in these parts. But you don't seem to be bad. Uh-huh. Okay, good enough. Enter! Uh-huh. Yikes! I'm so nervous. So jittery. But I'm glad we're finally allowed in. My heart's pounding, though. Okay, let's go in. All right. It's not. <laughs> There's a hatch that leads to the underground here. Oh. Oh, down we go. Wow. So this is Wigglytuff's guild. So many Pokemon. I wonder if they're all in, all on exploration teams. This is a certain bird, I'm pretty sure. Excuse me! It was you two that just came in, right? Uh, yes! I'm Chadot! I'm the Pokémon in the know around these parts. I am Guildmaster Wigglytuff's right-handed Pokémon. Now shoo! Leave the premises, we have no time for salespeople or silly surveys! Off you go, if you please. Uh, no! That's not why we're here! We want to form an exploration team! That's why we came. We want to be trained as an exploration team! W what Exploration team?! It's rare to see a kid like this want to apprentice at the guilds. Especially given how hard our training is. Surely the steady stream of Pokemon that run away from our rigorous training proves how true that is. Uh, excuse me. Is the exploration team training that severe? W what well, no, 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 no! It's not true in the slightest! Our training program for exploration teams is as easy as can be! Well, well, well! <laughs> I wish you had told me up front that you wanted to be an exploration team! <laughs> His attitude suddenly changed, didn't it? Yeah. Okay, let's get your team signed up right away. Follow me! Oh, anything wrong? Come on! Over here! Quickly, please! Okay. He beat your regrets! This is the guild's second underground floor. This is mainly where the apprentices work. Team registration is this way. Come along, please. <laughs> wow, there are two floors under the ground, but you can still see outside. Oh, please hush now. The guild is built into the side of a cliff. It's only natural that you would be able to see outside. Now, here we 
we are at Guildmaster Wigglytuff's chamber. On no account... I repeat, on no account should you be discourteous to our Guildmaster. Guildmaster! It's Chatot! I'm coming in! Okay. Guildmaster! I present to you two Pokémon who wish to join our guild as apprentices. Guildmaster? Um... Guildmaster? Hi there! I'm Wigglytuff! I'm the guild's Guildmaster! You want to form an exploration team? Then let's go for it! First, we must register your exploration team's name. So tell me your team's name. Uh, oh, our team's name? We didn't think of that. So, uh, what do you think would be a good name for us, Abby? Uh... Have fun. Nobody ever remembers this part. Uh... This truly is the hardest part. You can't do worse than some of us did as kids. Ah, Correct. yes, and as you choose a the team name, friends. Lucas Wigglytuff stares into your soul the whole time. <laughs> do, do the kid thing of just using your two Pokémon's names. I can't believe there's not a, a creepypasta about this. I'm Poke waiting! Pokepals is the canonical team. Team Furries. And so will it, like, put team as a prefix to this? Yes. 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 Oh... So, it, so if you went with the default, it won't have been Team Team Pokepiles. Uh, which is not great. Mm. Team I mean, Heck yeah. I the first one I did, which was Team Um Uh Um. <laughs> <laughs> ah. That's Just accurate. Biblically accurate uh, character names. Psychic Same and names. Psy Psychic and Aura. I feel like if that either, might be a good. If either of you were electric type, I'd say Team Double A. Uh -huh. Abby, I have a new um, emote for the new Twitch Duracell. channel. Oh, what's the emote? Just, just gonna message you it. Yeah, there we go. Oh boy. Oh, I mean, I could uh, FFZ it. Actually, wait a minute. Yeah, that's like instant, isn't it? I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah. All right. Let me see if I can add it to FFZ. Hold up. Oh, I don't want FFZ as an like. I want to add it as an emote. Yes. You have signed in emotes. Uh, search. Let's see if it's already in there. Oh, it's like searching ev. Okay, yeah, no. Public library. No, there is no... There's certainly a wiggly tough, but not the wiggly tough you suggested. Hold up, let me... Just drag that out and make it a emote in FFC then. Whoop, I put my name into the pot for suggestions. I'd like to see what everybody else comes up with. Team Resonant sounds pretty good. That's that's a, a yeah. really good team Reson name, actually. Resonance, yeah. And I think the character limit is really strict on this, and I'm pretty it sure is. that I think it's ten or I eleven. Think that's just underneath the bar. That's like the nine. <laughs> I like it. I like it. No. 
Yes, everybody take note of Wigglytuff just staring at you. I think the emote <laughs> should be live now. He's judging the you. Why is why is names? Why is the weekly tough staring into my soul? Wait, resonance. resonance. Can I major eye emoji eye emoji vibes? Eye emoji lip emoji eye emoji. <laughs> I'm not sure if it'll work, but we'll see. No, I don't know if you have to reload it. Uh, we have to reload, yeah. Uh, I That's did just I did just reload, and I don't see it still. It takes a minute or two. Okay. Uh, It'll get there. Don't worry. Alright. Anyway, resonant, while that's going resonant. on, I am going to quickly save state the game. Good idea. You mean and, save on your DS? Yes, and also see if I can figure out why saving itself isn't working. Uh, do you have any options for that? Yeah, I'm assuming you're using Melon. And... Uh, yes, I'm using Melon. Yeah. No, she's using a DS. The, uh, the melon. Yes. Nintendo Real DS. Yes, the melon. The melon flavor DS. Melon skin. It's 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 been reshelled to look like a melon. But if if no if someone knows how uh melon uh melon DSs save uh that would be appreciated. Path settings saves. I've path. only ever used Desmium. Huh? Uh, ditto. Same. Yeah, like, that's the oldest one, so that's the one everyone knows. Pretty much. Yeah. That's it. That's it. I gotta disappear again, but yeah. Resonant or resonance. That's my, that's the suggestion. Emulation? I think, reson I think huh? resonance is the... Yeah, I think resonance is better in my brain. Better. Yeah. Re resonance with a CE sounds better, personally, but yeah. Okay. So here's something that's scary. I the emulation has to reset for it to save where the settings for like where it will actually save save states. I've made a save state as a physical file. So, in theory, that should work. I should be able to restore from the save state. I just have to set the path, and we're gonna if pray not, that it we, works. Uh, might have to blitz through we, the first we, part. We yes. might have to blitz through the beginning. You don't have to voice act. We're basically it opens. Yeah. Oh, but we could do it like fast Chip and Dale style. Maybe. We'll see. <laughs> that or we could just go full DBZA with the first part that we have to redo. No, we're back. Yay! Oh, oh that was that was instant. Alright. Well, I'm gonna fix the save file. <laughs> yeah, Man, the DS was ahead of its time. Team Resonance? Yeah, uh, it seems to be between Resonant and Resonance. I like Resonance, personally. Yeah. I feel like it's still like being the the voice, uh, you know, the voice of the people is resonance, resonant. Is that is that cool with everybody? Team chat. I like it. I mean, I mean resonance, resonance is team. a good name. Yeah. Only person that yeah. needs to approve is your partner. That's well, very true. Well, do you like team resonance? I That's already fine. gave it my approval. Well, let's see if you do in game. Damn. <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> Resonance. Resonance. That's a weird name. That's fucked up. <laughs> Team Resident. Yeah, that's a good name. It suits us. All settled then. I'll register your team as Resonance. Registering, registering, all registered. Oh, the compressor yeah, took out it. the compressor took out the uh, ta in the yumta. <laughs> Congratulations! From now on, you're an official exploration team. I present you. With this in commemoration. Wigglytuff set down a Pokemon Exploration Team Kit. Pokemon Exploration Team Kit? That's what I just said. A Pokemon Exploration Team Kit? Yup. It's what every exploration team needs. Quick, open it up. 
Artemis opened the Pokemon Exploration Team Kit. How many times am I going to say this? There was an Explorer badge inside. And a Wonder Map. And a Treasure Bag. Yeah, there's all sorts of great items in here. That's your Explorer badge. It's your official team identification. And there's the Wonder Map, which is a wonder of convenience. Finally, there's a treasure bag. It lets you carry items you can find in dungeons. Couldn't you just put up everything in the exploration bag and then hand it us that? That's too easy. It would not look as easy. Ask questions. Your successes as an exploration team can lead you to bigger and bigger space for your treasure bag. It's a very wonderful bag. Have a peek inside your treasure bag. Artemis peered into the treasure bag. The defense scarf was inside. I need it! I need it! <laughs> <laughs> a silver belt was also inside. You can have that. Those two items are special. I'm sure they will help you on your adventures. Thank you! We'll do our best! Yep! But you're only apprenticing right now, so you do your best to train! We will! Silver is my aura, yes. Let's do our best, Abby. Always. Yeah! If only I could settle down. This is your room! Great! We get bed! You will live here while you work for us. Things will start to getting busy for you tomorrow! So rise early and start living up to our code. Don't stay up late! Get to sleep early tonight! That is all. Chatty bird, isn't it? Moon. <laughs> <laughs> I might not have the sleep sprites done right. I'm not sure. You're, you're, you're you know, before <laughs> bed exercises. You're calisthenics. Uh, calisthenics, yes. Before bed. Everybody likes to jiggle. <laughs> Come for uh, my daily midnight dance. Oh, <laughs> are, are you still awake, Abby? I hear you moving around over there. I can't get down! You don't say! <laughs> my heart's been racing all day. Today over every little thing. <laughs> this is more than just restless leg syndrome. <laughs> but I'm glad I finally made myself come here. I thought Wigglytuff would be scary, but he seems pretty friendly. We're going to experience all sorts of things starting tomorrow, but I'm not very scared. In fact, it's the other way around. I'm super excited about all the adventures we'll face. I'm feeling a little sleepy. Let's give it all our all tomorrow. Don't wear yourself out too much. Okay, Abby? Good night. I want to sleep! I'm asleep. Um... Now I'm suddenly apprenticing at the guild. I gotta admit, it's pretty exciting to be on an exploration team. It's fun to be friends with Artomas. But first things first. Who am I? How did I turn into a Pokemon? How did I end up unconscious on that beach? I'm feeling sleepy too. Well, thinking about it won't help right now. I better focus on the guild's work for now. If I do that, well, everything should become clear eventually. Surely I'll get to the bottom of this in time. <laughs> honk shoe, honk shoe. All right, let's see if saving works. No, I failed. Uh, you're going you to have to mainly do it, but now. Yeah. 
Uh, I'm going to make another save state here, and we'll see if it actually saves. Okay, it says... Yes, okay, it does have a save, slave, ugh, save state. What I'm going to do is I'm going to see if I can do something risky. I am oh going... I'm going to modify the ROM to see if I can make Abra have a normal Pokemon's Overland sprite set. No more dance, dance revolution at night. I'm going to see if I can sleep, yes. No, no, no more uh, treading uh, air while trying to sleep. I, I, I know I for a fact like... that is not going to work if you use a safe state. It's going to load this ROMs like... Oh, yeah. Mm. In, inserted I, data. I was also... Yeah. Um, I also wanted to point out that that game, this game, just has that as a bug in it. Um, so, for example, it—I was going to say this earlier, but um, it does—it does that even if you evolve. Like the sprite sheets that have the lying down and sleeping animations are special for just the main characters, and the animations explode on any of them, including even the main characters evolved later in the game. Huh. I guess I just have to suffer. I guess we'll, you're just going to be treading air while you sleep forever. We'll just, we are just going to imagine that Abby is not floating and we will go by the limits of the game because I am not rewriting this game any more than I already have. Unless I need to. Anyway, exploration team, quick tip. You can save a record of your progress. Can I? <laughs> You might need to restart, like, without using a safe state at some point. Uh, uh, one thing which I say, uh, found when I was quickly looking for that is that it might be because it needs, like, administrative per permission to uh, save in this folder because of where it uh, is. Possibly. Yeah, you might need to run the emulator with admin. That's fine, I can do that the, next the, time. The, the totally legal... Uh, Nintendo DS needs to be booted as admin. Ah, I see, I see. <laughs> the next morning... Hey! Hey there! Rise and shine! Ah! My head is pounding! What a ridiculously loud voice! It almost blasted my eardrums! Why are you still asleep? Wake up! <laughs> my, my poor ears! Come on, snap out of it! I'm Loudred! And I'm a fellow apprentice! If you're late for our morning briefing, you'll be sorry, so move it! Guildmaster Wigglytuff has got a big temper if you make him lose it. Yeah, we! That would be one very scary scene. I've got goosebumps just thinking about it. Yeesh! Uh-huh. So anyway... I'm not about to get in trouble because you rookies got up late. So get it in gear! Uh, my ears are still ringing. Are your ears the things pointing out of your head or the droopy bits? No, the things out of my head. We'll talk about that later. Okay. Uh, what did he say? Something about getting ready? Uh. Oh, yeah. We signed up as apprentices at Wigglytuff's Guild, that's right. Yeah, it happened last night, dude. I have short-term memory loss, I am Pupper. Oh. Um. But that means... Ah! We totally overslept! We gotta hurry, Abby! I sleep 18 hours! I underslept! You're late, rookies! Your voice is ridiculously loud! Hmm. Everyone seems to be present. Very well. 
Let us conduct our morning address. Guildmaster! The guild is in full attendance! Thank you, Guildmaster. Please address the crew. <laughs> Guildmaster Wigglytuff never ceases to amaze me. Yeah, you got that right. Yep. yep. Go ahead. Looks like he's wide awake. Yeah, his, his eyes, eyes are wide open. open. <laughs> he's fast asleep. <laughs> Sorry. That was great. Everyone is apprentice at the same time. <laughs> we don't know which one is which. Yeah, it doesn't say who. <laughs> we don't, we don't maybe, just someone. Yeah, everyone Jesus. Everyone just gets one line. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> Alright, so who is this one? It's Sunflora. I, alright. His eyes are wide open. He's fast, but he's fast asleep. Thank you, sir. We all value your... Words of wisdom. Okay, Pokemon, take our Guildmaster's words of wisdom to heart. That's natural for me. Finally, let's not forget our morning cheers. All together now. I pledge allegiance to the... A one. Oh, no, wait, this is everyone. That includes y'all. A one. One. A two. A one. A one. A two. Three. One. One. Don't, Don't shirt work. work. <laughs> Two! Run, Run away, away and pay! Three! Smiles go for miles! Okay, Pokemon, get to work! By the end of this game, we'll probably actually be able to do it correctly by the end of the game. Hey! <laughs> Is this a cult? <laughs> yes. Right. Yes! They even have some, some, you know, culted, cult dues and everything. Oh, huh. oh, that's very it's nice. Look at the top in place. The top I'm... screen has like this really very beautifully done map. Oh, I like how yeah. even while asleep, Wigglytuff still goes back into their office once the meeting's done. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What should we do? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't know either. Well, I think you have control. Oh. Hey, you shouldn't just be wandering around there. I haven't done a thing. You two come here. Oh, okay. How did a bird climb that? I don't know. How did I it. climb it? You're just beginners. We'll have you start off with this assignment. This is the job bulletin board. Pokemon from various regions post job requests here. Oh. You're aware that bad Pokemon are cropping up in greater numbers, right? Uh huh. Yep. Because the flow of time is getting messed up, it's wrecking havoc, right? You know, time travel. Which is why lots of bad Pokemon are appearing. The flow of time is getting messed up? Spoilers. Time is in, like, hours and minutes? Do they mean something's gone wrong with time here? And because of that, more and more bad Pokemon are popping up? What's going on here? Precisely. Time getting out of whack has caused an outbreak of bad Pokemon. Perhaps because of all that... We have noticed an increase in the number of jobs. In addition, and it's unknown if this is because of time's influence, there has also been a mass outbreak of... Does that increase shiny odds? Mystery dungeons. Oh. He's <laughs> the name. Wow, drop the title rune, don't you? 
Mystery dungeons? So, Abby. You know how we got my relic back fragment back yesterday? Yeah. The place where we found it was a mystery dungeon. Uh-huh. A mystery dungeon changes each time you go into it. There's a different layout and different items every time you enter. Huh. If you faint in the middle of a dungeon, you lose half your money. You can even lose half your items and or more. A dungeon can rob you? Finally, you get kicked right out. There's very they are very strange places. Yeah. But every time you go inside one, there's always new things to discover. Uh-huh. They really are fantastic places to go exploring. Well, you're quite informed, aren't you? That makes things much easier for me to explain. Jobs all take place in mystery dungeons. Huh. So, let's look for a job that you should perform. Ah, uh, yes! Maybe this will do! Oh, really? Let's read it. Hello, my name is Spoink. Does somebody want to become Spoink? Sir, hello, my name is Spoink. An outlaw has run off with my most prized possession, my precious pearl. That pearl is life itself, to me. I just can't seem to settle down if that pearl is in its proper place atop top of my head. But I've heard my pearl has been sighted. It's said to be on a rocky bluff, but this bluff is worn to be extremely unsafe. I could never go somewhere so frightening. Oh, friendly readers, would you be so kind as to go to the bluff and get my pearl? I beg your help, exploration team members. From Spoink. Wait a second. We're going to fetch an item that somebody dropped? Didn't they say they got robbed from them? I'd rather do something that's more of an adventure. I'd rather look for treasure, explore unknown places, things like that. Yikes! It's important that you rookies pay your dues! Now pay attention! I'll repeat the warnings again to make sure they stick. You'll be forced out of a dungeon and sent back here if either of you faints. Either. You'll lose half your money. And you could lose half your items or more. You'd best be careful. If you've understood all that, I suggest you get on with the job. Mm. This must be the bluff's entrance. Spoink's mission description said the pearl would be deep down on the B7 floor level. Okay. Sounds like a seriously dangerous place. Let's be careful. Okay. Let's do our best, Abby. Yeah. Huzzah. This game's a total ripoff of Chocobo Mystery Dungeon. <laughs> oh. You and your partner can now hold one item each. Now that you have a treasure bag, you can also keep 16 items in your inventory. Some items, like bows, only work with held by a Pokemon. You see, use the Give option found under Item section of the menu to hand it over. I made friends with a Shellos. Uh, you're- 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 Ah! Oh! It's not happy. No, it isn't! Yeah, they- they heard what I said about Mystery Dungeon. <laughs> Damn. You can eat a blast seed to breathe fire at a target in front of you. To use, open the menu, select items, and select eat. Any Pokemon can become dragon. Any Pokemon can create a bomb. Yeah. I grew to level 7! I can learn a new move. But I must get rid of an old move first. Swift. Yeah. I'm going to get rid of Kinesis. HP went up one. My attack went up one. My special attack went up one. 
definitely uh, two things. Um, make sure you read some of the, the move descriptions, because the, a lot of them do work differently in PMD than they do in the, the regular games. Mm -hmm. I mean, not drastically, but like there are some with either unique effects or like that do something or or that do something different. Like substitute. Uh, yeah. Um. Uh, the other thing that I was gonna ask is, um, are you planning on, uh, how much of the game are you planning on doing? Are you planning on doing the main story or like as much of it as you? Uh, can. I was gonna do main story, and then I guess when it's appropriately timed, the side missions. Okay, then I don't have to... I, I was going to make some recommendations, but I don't have to do that if you're not planning on, like, getting close to 100%. Okay. It's a no post game. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, which honestly, Plus... for Abby's sake, is pretty good. Considering. So can I? Ah, I can't go yeah, into the water. water type. Yeah. You are not yeah. actually floating <laughs> Me mechanically. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> no, it, the the secret is is that Abby actually sits on one of those hoverboards from Back to the Future. Oh. They don't work on water. Oh. I guess if we had other people that did want to join us for voice acting, I know. Uh, there are some people very excited the moment that they learned that uh, we were doing this. I would very much like to join us in this chat. If anybody is interested in doing that and is on my Discord, uh, either DM me or say something. Well, we can we can wiggle you in here. Wiggle. Hey, I hope it's also okay. I take the uh, magnet boy. I think you're good. Yeah, I think you're good. Make sure you write it down. I just thought of asking Fred. Yeah. <laughs> Already uh, done. Okay. Um, and if anybody who says that they want to join in, if I know a couple people in this chat are mods, if you just give them the PMDVA role, they should be able to hop in. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Um. Eat an apple or a gummy when you get hungry. If you eat, if, or if you get too hungry, you'll risk fainting before long. So keep an eye on your belly in the menu. Oh, I have to look at my tummy now and then. Abby, I'm hungry. No, you're not. We just got in here. But I'm hungry. Team members will earn experience points when they defeat an enemy, and they'll level up when you earn enough of them. I don't Pokemon. think team members have belly to worry about, do they, in this one? No, they do not. No, they don't. Yeah, that was only in PMD1, I think. A Pokemon they will did. get... Oops. Sorry. A Pokemon will no, get... It's... More HP, raise stats, and a po le even possibly learn a move, move every time it levels up. So battle hard to level up more often. Okay, sorry about that. Uh... You know, it's your uh, typical RPG. So if I hit B and A, that skips a turn. Yes. That's a big time skip. Okay. Usually, uh, you, usually you just use the basic attack to pass time instead of B and A. You can't attack around corners unless it's like water tile. No, uh, you can't see Swift, Swift Wicks. Who's had that uh, cut corners? Huh. Some attacks go around uh, solid corners, others don't. Alright, Thomas uh, grew to level 7. Excellent! Yeah. I leveled up! It's, it's the attacks which can travel to tiles which go around corners. They'll uh. say that in the targeting. Okay. Damn, Artomas, your stats are going crazy compared to mine. Well, hey, you know. old big stats, so they should be more or less equal. Well, Artomas has, like, no HP compared to me. Yeah. Eating an apple or gummy fills your belly. Eat one if you're about to faint from hunger. 
Do so, and you find other items, and then select eat. Um, if you want to swivel rather than walking, uh, that's Y. Okay. On the DS. Ah. Whee! Hey. Abby has unlocked spin. Spin! Well, my I, money. Can't, I can't get the money now. Abby, I have a plan. If I dive into the water and you grab me and teleport me back up, can we get the money? Yeah, we'll just grab you by your tail. Yes. Wait a minute. Grab him by the aura dingles. The aura dingles? That's what they're called? Aura feelers, thank you very much. Mm-hmm. Aura castles. Aura dreads. Oh, hey. Here, do you want to get the New York? Hey, I'm walking here. <laughs> What's our belly at? Oh, our belly isn't down even that much. Yeah, you don't. Nah, have to overall, you won't need to eat later. for like a little bit. Yeah, um, you won't even have to worry about that mechanic until you start seeing like twenty-four dungeons, uh -huh. and, so, and at least. Well, it depends on how long you stay in the dungeon. I'd say about when you get to maybe five dungeons in, depending on on how fast you are at it. Okay. Um, well, so it'll. If I may. I'm sorry, go ahead, uh, Corp. Corp. I was gonna say, you can, you can get a warning when you're getting low on your mace. Yeah, I was gonna say that. Yeah, you were gonna get a warning. Okay. If there's a problem. And That's good. running in the corridors drains belly faster. I thought it was just a speed up. It, Does it, it is actually just drain a speed up? Yeah. It, it is just a speed up, and um, it's because uh, belly decreases by like a tenth of a belly per turn or something like that like a small fraction but it that's that's also why hanging around take uh takes it up ah oh. so it's not oh. that uh, running through the holes uh, ways that makes it to uh, drop faster it's that it's just moving really fast yeah you're yes. not actually losing more hunger you're just moving quickly so you don't you know you don't notice it going down at normal rate. Okay. If hunger's not an issue, you can just straight up wait and heal by holding down B and A. Mm -hmm. Which, it won't be an issue for the first couple of short dungeons. Oh, or if you yeah. know you're going to leave. Basically... Oh, wait. Is that the medals? ammo? Throw them by holding L and R. These are surprisingly more useful than you might think. Hmm. Yep. I mean, being able to have 99 in a single stack so you can have 99 things to throw at people. They do a lot more damage than you might think as well. You gotta set like, it first. Uh, uh, they throw so you a rock at somebody? It'll be your held item. No, 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 no. no. You can set an item. Oh. There you go. Yeah, no, you can just chuck it, actually, from the bag. Okay. Now every time you hit L and R... In an old-school RPG, this would be like finding a bow, which, back in 90s RPGs, that is a pretty big deal. True. I um, mean, if it was, uh, like, Shire and the Wanderer, it would be a bow. Yeah, exactly. The particularly useful property that the stones have in the game is that they do fixed damage always. And they oh. go through walls. Yeah, any thrown item has a fixed damage. They can miss, though. Uh, spikes do not have fixed damage. Spikes are nope. based on your attack. Really? Yep. Alright. Yep. But, to be discovered, you know? Pokemon's HP gets low, puts itself at great risk from fainting from further enemy attack. When it happens, just run away! 
you can very much use your partner as a meat shield. Like, if you're in a hallway, it is a perfectly viable strategy. Yellow gummy. Orange berry. Gumby. Ah, uh, orange uh, berry. Ah, uh, yes. Fake Go items. Look -alikes. They return with a vengeance. <laughs> it's a lookalike item. Check item info to make sure it's got the right item and not one of the sneaky lookalikes. Hmm. Huh. Kinda sad that these are exclusive to this game. Make sure that you have a revival seed and not a revisor seed. Yeah, and also you want to be careful not to have a st bleh. You want to be careful to have a stun seed and not... These nuts! Oh, okay. I, it sounded smarter in my head. Uh huh. Uh, You're fine. How does one mic sound? Is it any better now? Sounds Dude, good that me. failed That's joke good. reminds me of the uh, Mario and Luigi RPG of nut, big nut, maximum nut. Max. <laughs> <laughs> I love that meme so goddamn much. If you don't want to have to um, pay too much attention to the lookalike items, the short description always has dot 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 question mark for them. Ah. Oh. Help your partner be a smart teammate by tweaking its IQ stills and tactic settings. You can find these under the team. You can also use a swift option to keep your partner from using certain moves. I'm stupid. Yeah, not for long. Money! What is that yellow gummy we got? Force feeding my boyfriend gummies to unstupid. Mm. Ow. Crazy IQ of a team member, electric pipe Pokemon like it the most. I think you get some bonuses if you're weak to it, as well as if you're super yes. effective against it. Yeah. Mm. But like different bonuses. Okay. Should I hold on to it then for whenever we have another team member that might benefit from it? Uh, was this uh, the game no, where you, you could just... go on? You should just feed it to Artemis. Um uh Basically, you, they do show up quite a bit. Um, you don't have to be choosy about the the type matchup. Um, note, note and, that it's also it's also a good option in case you go hungry. Yeah, it's also a good option in case you go hungry. It's um, good emergency ration food. Mm -hmm. But but also uh, the um, the IQ skills that you get. Um, there there are a couple of. Uh, like important ones, like move PP checker that you might want to have. Yeah. Okay. So if I do eat, will it give me a menu where either I eat it or our Thomas eats it? Correct. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Want to make sure. <laughs> Unlike the first Pokemon Mystery Dungeon game. <laughs> okay. <laughs> our Thomas have a gummy. Yay! Somewhat. Yes. Dude, I need to put up this peanut butter. It's so good. So yeah, it is my first playthrough. Um, Abby and this... knows my weakness. She gave me fruit gummies. Uh huh. And yeah, we've yeah. modded it so that I can play as an Abra, and that is pretty much it. There are a couple other bug fix mods and whatnot that were available, as well as adding fairy types to the game. But it did not add any fairy moves. So fairy types and like its resistances, weaknesses, and strengths exist, but there are no fairy moves because it's Gen 4. So fairy gummies might show up now and then, apparently, which is interesting. She also buffed the Abra's. Uh, yeah, no, I made Abra stats similar to Vulpix uh, and made it so it had it better uh, distributed moveset rather than just teleport. Oh, look at that. That must be Spoing's Pearl. Let's hurry back with it. Now the child will no longer stop its heart. Reggie? Thank you! That bell must have been popped on my head, you see? I missed it so much! I just couldn't slow down without it up there! So I was just boinging and springing everywhere! That's why I'm covered in things and bumps! But thanks to you, that long nightmare is over! You have my sincere thanks! 
Pro protein. It's Tom the Bulk. Where did you get that protein from, Spoink? Don't worry about it. Don't you know, Spoink gets the gym. Uh, we also got milk. Calcium. I mean, protein and, is uh, found in nuts, too. We got the whole food group. $2,000! It was preventing his heart from stopping, to be fair. Yeah? Wow! $2,000? All this money is for us? Reggie? Reggie! Reggie! Of course, of course, that's nothing compared to my pal's value. Farewell! How did it hop up a ladder? Yeah, I was wondering about that. We're rich, we Yanni! We got rich it. just like that! We're rich! Well done, team! Now, hand that money over, if you please. Huh? Most of the money from jobs goes to the Guildmaster, you see. And your team's share of the money comes out to this much. Huh? We only get to keep 200? That's 10%. Taxes. That's awful! Well, that's the guild's rule. You simply have to accept it. Huh. Sounds um, like capitalism. Unfortunate. To be fair, they give you a room to sleep in, they give you food. They yeah, also take care of finding the jobs. Everyone! Oh, I hate the eating scenes. Who's Chibeko? Everyone! Mimi. Thanks for waiting. I finished making dinner. <laughs> you have involuntarily given Mom, the king's voice. Gone. Yes. I wonder what's for dinner. Yeah! yeah. 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 Look at Loudry go. Dude. Fitting. He, he also has a white button nailed down. down. Uh, oh my god! I always used to mute my DS during these. Fair enough. Yeah, oh. no, that noise is kind of... Going uh. absolutely feral for food. I'm done eating. Excellent meal. I'm stuffed. Now I'm getting sleepy. Yep, Mum, off to bed. Good night, gang. Good night. Please, someone weigh me down. Please, please, someone weigh me down. <laughs> Listen, Abby, you really don't have to run every night. It gets. Hmm. I can't say hectic though. So much happened. I can't stop it. <laughs> you know that abras are actually part shark. They don't stop swimming when they're asleep. <laughs> okay. Look, on the back side, there's a roof, so at least you won't float away. There's a window. You're gonna have the thickest thighs when you evolve. That's for sure. <laughs> oh. No. Oh. No. no. Not not even but not even when you evolve beforehand. Oh. Oh. But I'm relieved that our first job was a success. It was really upsetting how Wiggly Tough Guild took most of the money. That's just the cost of training, I guess. We can't do anything about it. But what made me really happy today though was getting thanked by Spoink. Uh I'm getting sleepy. I'm gonna sleep. Hopefully you don't just keep running all night again. It, just it, uh, just give me a very large rock. I, I think I'll be fine if I just am weighed down. Don't you have like my ten geo pebbles? Let's try our best again tomorrow. Good night, Abby. Good night. I miss beds. <laughs> Let me bed, forget <laughs> leg day. Let's it's go for the right money, here. suckers! Chapter the 3. Tadatsuru, a trial enemy. Chapter 3. The Scream!
The next morning... Open at him! It's morning! <laughs> Good morning, Abby. I've been oh, doing calisthenics all night! Would you like to save your game? <laughs> we would yeah. like to. <laughs> Save uh, mail. Continue on. Yeah, I'm gonna. <laughs> that's just that's just part of the voice acting. Save I, mail. I'm going to look into the save thing. You keep playing. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. It's and three. three. Smile, Smile go so for miles. Hey, Pokemon. Time to get to work. Hooray! Hey! Hey! Bye, everybody. Well, I know that we're immediately going to get told what to do today, so... So what should we do today? Get told what to do by chat -out. I don't know if that's <laughs> how that's going to work. <laughs> oh, you two. Still wandering around lost, it seems. It's our second day. Well, come with me. Eh. Yeah. Get to meet a friend. I'm sorry, I had to. I couldn't help it. Huh? Last time we did a job, it was over on that board on the other side. Correct. Today, we'll have you do a job listed on this side. How is it different from the board on the other side? Take a closer look. Oh, look, Abby. There are posters up that show a variety of Pokemon. Wow, they all look pretty cool. Are they famous explorers? Where are these Pokemon, Chatot? The Pokemon posted here are outlaws. Oh. <laughs> they're all shady characters, and they're wanted for committing crimes. Oh, no. They're outlaws. So, there are bounties on their heads. Their heads? In other words, oh. there is a cash reward if you capture one. Do we need to bring them all in, or just the head? <laughs> <laughs> there are so many aggressive Pokemon around these days that everyone's finding it hard to keep up with the problem. Wait. You're telling us to go catch these outlaws? You can't be serious. That's not possible. <laughs> Just joking. Or am I? The bad Pokemon out there come in all shades of badness. Some of these Pokemon are completely wicked through and through. But there are also bad Pokemon who are merely petty thieves. So you've got evil to naughty, and everything in between. What if you just have naughty nature? You're automatically on the so, list. I'm sure we can avoid giving you a job catching a super bad Pokemon. Make lovin'. <laughs> that was terrible. So, Thank you. Look over these posters, then pick a Pokemon that looks weak enough for you to bring to justice. <laughs> um... You say some are weak, but they're still bad Pokemon, aren't they? I'm scared of dangerous Pokemon. It's all Finally, you'll get to experience the through it, sure. laughing face. But I suppose you do need to be prepared to confront a tough opponent. So, I'll have someone give you a tour of the facilities. Thank you for the resub, Mindacoss. Hey, Bidoof! Bidoof! Yop yop. Haven't you called? Ah, Bidoof! These are the new recruits that just joined us. Take them and show them around the town. 
Yes, sirree. By golly, I'll do just that. Yup, yup. This is Bidoof. He's one of your fellow apprentices. I want you to pay attention to what Bidoof has to say and follow his orders. Off you go! Aw, shucks. I'm overjoyed. Oh, Why's that? I'm glad to have members junior to me. I'm almost overcome right now. Oh. I might just blubber with happiness. Before y'all signed on, I was the most recent rookie. Hmm. Well, I'd best show you around. Come with me, please. First things first. Here, we have Crow Gunk. Uh, but to tell you the truth, I don't have any idea what that Pokemon's up to. He always seems to be fiddling around with that big cauldron back there. It's all a mystery to me, yup yup. Over this way is the mess hall. And if y'all look that way, you'll find the crew rooms. Hey, it's me, Chetot. <laughs> and this here leads to the Guildmaster's Chamber. Next, I'll guide you both around places outside the guild. Edith, how do you feel about Chatot's money laundering? Chatot's what now? Uh, don't worry about it. Oh, Peter. <laughs> <laughs> I hear you can make a record of your adventure at that watering hole. Usually, you make a record of your adventure by going to your bed at the guild, yup yup. Seems you can make a record of your adventure over there, too. Boy, I wish that worked! By golly, it's a handy spot when you want to record your adventure frequently. And this is the main square for the local Pokémon. It's called Treasure Town. Oh. I can tell you about Treasure Town, too. Now over there is Duskull Bank. We can save our money there. Huh. He won't steal it, I promise. Uh-huh. Over there is the Electivire Link Shop. That's where you can do things like leak moves together, but... Looks like Electivire isn't here today. Here we have the Kecleon Market, where you can buy and sell items here. And there's Kangaskhan's storage. Items stored here will never be lost. If you have precious items that you can't afford to lose, store them here before you go out on an adventure. And those are the basic places that exploration teams visit. Okay. And that should do it. You sure know a lot, yes siree. And that's good to know. Alright then, come find me when y'all ready to go. I'll give you a helping hand with selecting the right outlaw for you. Oh, like a dating service. Thank you, Bidoof. You've been really nice. G golly, you're embarrassing me. Oh, shucks. I'll be waiting at the guild's upper underground floor for you. Huh. All right, let's go. I'd like to see what kinds of items are available. Let's go to the Kecleon Market. Before we head back, a visit to the Kecleon Market is a must. Okay. 
with all the money that I stole from you. Fuck you, Chatot! Jeez! <laughs> <laughs> I By did way, end up looking sorry. around for Melon Diaz and anybody else that might be having similar saving issues with PMD, and it kind of sounds like that's just a thing that sometimes happens with ROM hacks with uh, Melon Diaz. I see. That it you... saves states the whole time. Yeah, except that some features might require you to go back to the title screen. And oh. it means that you're, you definitely cannot do the post game. <laughs> Yeah, oh. you might might want to do the swap over to this Mume, the other DS simulator. We'll yeah. take care of that after this stream, though. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah I can wait. Yeah. Who wants Scorefish? Who wants to be a fish? I already picked Sudden Flora. It wouldn't... I feel like they talk to each other often. Hey, 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 you there! You're the new rookies in the guild, aren't you? Hey, hey! My name's Corfish! I'm an apprentice at winning a tough skill just like you! Hey, hey! If you... If you don't know what's going on or whatever, come ask me! You got that? Hey, hey! Thanks. Hey, let's talk to this flower. You! Oh my gosh! The new guild recruits! Delighted to meet you! You can get all sorts of things here. It's quite convenient. Do you build a stock of items that will help you in explorations? Huh. Oh. Hello? There's a notice posted here. Something's written on it. Murawak Dojo has collapsed. But will rise from the rubble again. Yes, the dojo will be resurrected to its former glory. Murawak Dojo Sensei. Not the people that were inside when it collapsed, however. Uh-huh. Uh. I, I could do this one. Go for it. We're a two-member exploration team. We're Sega and Pidgey. Our, our team name is CG. CG. Combines our names. So remember it. That's cute. Well, how you evolve? Doesn't that make it problematic? I think that's actually not for the station that comes up. Exploration teams gather here from all over. Our town, our own team, Siji is one of them. Hmm. Welcome to Dust Skull Bank. How may I help you? <laughs> how much do you want to deposit? Three dollars. <laughs> <laughs> that voice is cracking me up. I don't know why. It will rest here in peace forever, if you wish. Your bank balance is three dollars. Now, how may I serve you? <laughs> it's just like real life. I look forward to your next visit. <laughs> uh. I like that it sounds like just a regular bank teller. <laughs> it would be a very forced laugh. <laughs> Is it called I can Team Tasty uh, uh, Swallow? Yeah. Let me take on this one. Go for Our it. Our exploration yeah. team is called Team Tasty. That cool name was thought of by my partner Wormpole next to me. What do you think? Cool name, am I right? Help me. Oh no. <laughs> Somebody wants to pick this one? I will. Excuse me? Excuse me? Excuse me? Why did I pick up the name Team Tasty? Well... Uh... Um... I think that's how my father would think of me eventually. <laughs> oh. That's unfortunate. He's self-aware! Uh, he's self-aware! <laughs> Pokemon eating each other is in fact a reality of this world. Uh huh. That's true. Especially this world. Yo! Are you two the new guild apprentices at the guild? Then hello! The name's Vigoron. I'm no good at sitting still. I'm always bursting with energy. 
looks like Adam. Great to meet ya! Yeah, I know. I feel you on that one. I, I can probably get this one. Hold on. Minecraft! My favorite thing, darlings? Well, do I ever have an eye for sparklies? I keep telling my partners you should seek out flashy baubles and glamorous glitz. But Shuppet always reacts coolly to my suggestions. But she seems not to hear. Or he just won't listen. Ah, oh, it's so aggravating. Oh, Carol, do you want it? Yeah, I have something else in mind. Yeah. We are Team Ebony. We've traveled and explored all over. Great! Great! Real cool! Hello there. Welcome to the Kangaskhan storage. What would you want to store? You can just you choose more than one item or R and L to select everything. Thank you, Scott, and breaks the fourth wall. Oh. Hope you like Treasure Town music, by the way. Yeah. It's good music. I don't know. I, I like I like red and blue town theme better, but Does anyone even remember the third official game? I do. Uh, you. you mean... The bad one. They we, the, the one that... I liked it. The one we, that... I mean, I like it, especially since I got to the end. It's just... It doesn't feel right. Wait, you people are talking about Gates to Infinity, right? Yeah. 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 That's not the third one. The third one is unspeakable. Oh, isn't that the one that came out on, like, Wii? The Wii, yeah. yeah. The third one's unspeakable, but it is still the third one. I mean, does, uh, does it actually have the Mystery Dungeon title? Yes! Yes, 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 yes. it does. <laughs> it was not good. I beat it. It was certainly a Mystery Dungeon game. It was a game. Let's head yeah. over to Kefli on Market, Abby. I mean, I played both Poke Welcome Park. to the Kecleon shop. Listen, Poke Park at least has, like, cool gameplay and some interesting characters. The WiiWare Mystery Dungeon game was about... Not much. I, I, I see why it's unspeakable. Mm -hmm. Your Orenberry? I can pay you 5p for that. Will you sell it for that price? Was that one. Should I sell these not good items? Yes. It's decent early money, but Done later deal. on, Thank they're you. better to just use. Just don't wish to sell people. anything else? Just throw them at somebody or something. Okay. Game is quite generous with Orn Berry, thankfully. Uh, and you can typically, like, just power through most status effects. Uh, okay. Um, can I give a brief suggestion? Sure. Okay. This is just like a rule of thumb for something I do when I'm playing the game, but when it comes to storing and or selling items, I try to make sure my inventory is like at about the 50% point of being full. So I you typically don't go in with too many things. Yeah. I try to keep it to only one page, personally. At this point, yeah. I only have two pages worth of size. Yeah, that well, would be hence, the case here. Hence, yeah, like, I would. That, yeah, let's just let it. Let's just let her play. Let's just yeah, I, I was giving yep. a suggestion. But yep. At this point, just know, be wary that anything learn. that you can't put in your bag will be left on the floor. Yep. Yeah. So you want to make sure you have plenty of space, but at the same time, you don't want to go in underprepared. Okay. Pretty much. Yeah, you silver gummies. Ooh. Silver gummies. Steel Pokemon. But you're just a fighting type. For now. For you the have, moment. You have an advantage on steel, though. So you Correct. get something out of it. But yeah. I don't think you have 800. Yeah, even if we sold everything. Oh. 
That auto advanced. I didn't hit a button. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, sometimes yeah. that happens. All right. So, ah, who little Meryl and Azuril. Welcome, my young friends. Hello. May I buy an apple? Oh, most certainly. Meryl and Azuril bought an apple at Kecleon Market. Thank you, Mr. Kecleon. No, thank you, my young friends. You are to be admired. You see, those delightful children are brothers. Lately, their poor mother has fallen sick. So those youngsters come to do the shopping for her. Aww. It's quite Precious. remarkable. Though very young, they stepped up and taken charge. Mr. Kecleon. Oh? What's the hurry? What makes you return in such a rush? There was an example! We didn't pay for this many. Oh, yes. That, young friends, is a gift from me and my brother. Please share it among yourselves, and do enjoy. Really? Yay! Thank you, Mr. Kekleon and Mr. Kekleon! <laughs> oh, not to worry, my friends. Do take care on your way home. Children. We're sorry to bother you, but thank you so much. Abby gave the apple back to Azrael, but then suddenly, ah, uh, was that dizzy, or am I? That was dumb. Help! What was that? I'm sure I, I'm sure I heard a help, shout for help just now. D did that shout come from you? Is something the matter? Hey, Zoom Wheel. What's going on? Are we home? Yup! I'm coming! Wait up! Are you alright? Yup! Wait, then we are shopping now. Look at oh, Looks like I am that lost. Let's get going. Yup! I'm coming! Ha! These little guys are so cute. Uh. Oh? What's the matter, Abby? Uh. Huh? Did I hear a shout for help just then? Uh huh. Uh, no, I didn't hear anything like that. Huh. Hey, Kecleon Brothers. Did you hear anyone or anything strange just a moment ago? Uh, no, nothing out of the ordinary. I didn't hear anything odd either. Sounds like the Kecleon brothers didn't hear anything odd either. You must have imagined it, Abby. What do you mean? No, I'm positive I didn't imagine that. I, I definitely heard it. A shout that I heard. Help! There's no mistaking it. That is... That was Azrael's scream. Huh? Are you David dreaming? Let's move it, Abby. Uh-huh. Hey, Come I'm on. gonna just... I'm just gonna eat this, uh... This special attack juice. 
You only do in dungeon, I think. What? You can't do in dungeons. No, but I was gonna just boost my special attack anyway. Like, is this gonna be a permanent stat? This should be permanent, right? Yeah, it's permanent. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Of course. So I, I make, make that more of a. You, you. Oh, you I gave, gave your it. I gave yeah. Them. You have to use Sorry, it in I'm the dungeon, I think. Is, is, uh, that's what I was saying. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Well, we can use it when we get back there. Yeah, it fills the belly anyways. Abby, so. I, I found I found what the help sounded like. What the help sounded like? In, in, in the oh. Voice Can't get enough. Back with another note. Help! As we wait patiently. <laughs> Man just goes right into NPC mode. <laughs> that's what he heard. That's why that's why she was asking, wait, like what did anybody else hear that? No. No. Everybody's just gas gaslighting, gatekeeping, girl bossing happy. But I'm the girl boss. Yeah. <laughs> no. Not anymore. Uh. Oh. Oh. What's going on there? Yay! Thank you. <laughs> Please, it's nothing. What's going on? Oh, hi! So Tiger, we lost an item that's pretty important to us. We've been looking all over. But we haven't found it yet. Then Mr. Drowsy came along. He said you must have seen the last item somewhere. You have to help us look for it. Oh, huh? I've been I've been turned into a PNG. Don't worry, I'll get better in a moment. We'll just keep going. As We're bouncy so as we are Yeah, that's great for you. Thank you, Mister Twowsy. Oh, please. I'd have to have a cold heart to ignore kids in need. I can't turn a blind eye. Uh-huh. Let us be on our way to begin our search. Uh-huh. Yep. Yep. Uh, uh -huh. Whoops. Excuse me. Uh, uh, what is this? That drowsy sure is a nice Pokemon, isn't he? I'm impressed. With more and more bad Pokemon around, it's hard to do good deeds. It it's happening again. Everything is fine. Another dizzy spell. If you keep being difficult, it will mean big trouble for you. <laughs> Help! What was that? It would be nice if those little guys found their item soon. Huh? What's the matter, Abby? You're looking awfully grim. Uh, hmm? You want to tell me something? Yeah! Let's move uh, more in public to talk. Front of the bank, yeah. What? You had a dizzy spell? Then you saw Azrael being threatened by Drowsy? Yeah. So you want to go at rescue Azrael right away? Yeah. It's an emergency. Yeah. Well, what you described does sound like an emergency, but... Well, it's not like I don't trust you, Abby, but... I just can't believe it. I'm a psychic Pokemon! Yeah, I'm a stupid fighting totally. type. After all, Drowsy seemed to be a sincerely nice Pokemon, didn't he? 
I watched the three of them go off earlier. My line literally sees the future in its ladder evolution steps. Literally has the move future sight. Yes, at level 47. Normally, in this, I had to adjust it downward. I think it's like 37. It looked like they were having a good time, though, didn't they? No! You're probably just tired, Abby. How dare you! Maybe that's why you just had a bad daydream. Look, just because I was asleep 18 hours. Was that it? Just a bad daydream. Oh, but come to think of it, that drowsy didn't seem like a bad Pokemon. Anyway, we're only apprentices. We can't just do whatever we want. I'm sure it's worrying, but... We have to concentrate our guild work for now. Uh-huh. Let's get ourselves ready to explore. Then we should find Bidoof. Bidoof's supposed to be waiting for us at the, guild, at the guild's upper underground floor. Let's go, Abby. I told you I'd be doing like 80% of the talking, by the way. Yeah. It's, I kind of have to just kind of ad lib filling stuff in. It's, it's, but then that means you get to listen to our tone. It's a beautiful voice that much more. Uh huh. Yep. Uh huh. This is giving me practice for Zelda thought next week. <laughs> I wonder. I wonder if a picture of Drowsy will be on that wanted poster wall. Gee, I wonder. Gee, I wonder. Gee, I wonder. Gee, I wonder. Gee, Wilkie wonders. Listen, Abby. <laughs> when it comes to picking an outlaw, didn't Bidoof say he'd help us? Even though he's standing right beside us, you talk to the board instead of Bidoof, so we're going to come up with this comical line, which does absolutely nothing for game progression. Let's ask Bidoof for his advice. For seven year olds. For like five year olds. Aww. Are you folks all set and ready for some exploring? Yeah, sure. Oh boy. Oh yes, sirree. I reckon you all are all ready. Then let's pick ourselves a lawbreaker for you to find. I can't believe the Midwest is in Pokemon. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> I can absolutely believe the Midwest is in Pokemon. <laughs> He's got literally southerners. Called, this is literally one called Mudsdale. Of course there is. No, nah, that's fair. That checks out. There are <laughs> technically three feral. regions that all take place in America. 30 to 50 feral sports. America! Well, you got your pick of this sorry bunch of characters. Let's see. Which should we pick? Him. As your mentor, how about I do the choosing? Don't choose anyone too scary. Yes, sir. I hear you. Let's see. Meeny, meeny. Stand clear. Updating listings. Stand clear. Updating listings. What's that? What's happening? Oh, the data's getting updated. Is this the internet? It's being updated. <laughs> Manual internet. <laughs> Yippee, did you see that? The panel flipped over. What's going on here? There's no more outlaws. They're all gone. Oh, we, we solved crime. The outlaw notice board and job bulletin board are set up on a revolving panel. While the panel is flipped over, a Pokemon named Doug Trio swaps out the old jobs with the new ones. Doug Trio? Updating data is Doug Trio's duty. He tunnels his way to our guild. 
Then he flips the panel and updates the data. Shouldn't Doug Trio's pronouns be they, them? <laughs> they, them, plural. <laughs> I mean, you're right. Mm -hmm. This data, th sorry, this duty doesn't get noticed much, but it's very important. Yup, yup. Uh, that's why Doug Trio takes such great pride in the duty he does. Is that so? Oh, I'm huge compared to you now. Oh, hi. Uh, the, the chibi is not yeah, scaled appropriately. That. Yeah. <laughs> is that so? Update complete. Stand clear. I'm massive. Update complete. Stand clear. I'm bigger in marketable plush form. Oh, looks like he's done. Yes, sirree. The data is updated. Nice. The list of outlaws has been refreshed, so let's pick one. Hmm. Huh? What's ailing you? Why are you shivering all of a sudden? Are you supposed to vibrate? I'm vibrating. Yeah, I'm supposed to. Brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Yeah, that's what these are, right? That's fully a yeah, that's working yeah. equipment. Yep. Pretty sure in the OG original, you had to equip every time you entered a dungeon. Jesus. Oh my god. It sucked. No, 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 you don't. No, I'm talking like the very first one, though. On the Game Boy Advance, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I... I no, you didn't. Remember. Oh, I'm wrong then. Are you sure? It's been years. I literally I just played it while I was waiting for my lines to come up. Oh, oh. there you go then. Well, that... I'm wrong too then. Hey, a fighting oh, type gummy! Ah, oh, perfect. Yay! I get smarter. <laughs> IQ went up significantly. Went up significantly. I am smart. Heck yeah. Oh, okay, good. Yeah, you can punch this. I don't have fighting type moves yet, except for counter. Well, get countering. That's technically not considered even fighting type. Do something. I can bite. I, I can attract it. Like the rock. Like the rock. Eat rocks. Eat rocks right now. The right rock now. loves me. He's dead now. <laughs> he died for his love. Uh-oh. Well, we're just gonna... I was gonna say, you got that. It's like, oh! A fighting type. How unfortunate. <laughs> it's running! Get it! Check bite description. The fun thing about uh, this game is that Pokemon actually flee. Ah. Oh. Before they, they did not. That. Yeah, ah, think... cringe. Are you both immune to that? Cringe? Yeah, we're both immune to cringe. It's pretty great seeing our tome is bopping back and forth and blinking in tune with the music. Oh, they just stepped away, but their 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 character just is vibing, I guess. Like no one's in front of the camera, but the art tome is Marilu is <laughs> oh, no, acting on its wire. own. The vessel is gaining sentence. <laughs> it's self-aware. Oh, get back here! Oh, you crit him! Oh my god! The du duo's... Uh, you saw that little puff of smoke, right? Yeah. Like, weaker Pokémon, if you hurt them enough, they'll get scared of you and run away. Ah. Uh, uh -huh. It's Pokémon that specifically have the ability to run away. Yep. Not everything, just some things. Okay. It's pretty fun to have, like, a bunch of them just run around the map and then go into your room, then turn right around. It's, Baby! Um, it's actually sort of important if you ever have one as a partner, uh, because if it's in your party, um, they're affected by it, too. Um, oh. Yeah. I've got Ru stick- Runaway is a really bad ability in this game. <laughs> it is, but it also could be good with preserving reviver seeds. Warp Seed? So teleport. <laughs> they turned my ability into a seed! <laughs> All hit orb. I do love the PMD series for at least, like really encouraging you to use items, unlike regular Pokemon games. Is this true? Mm -hmm. I mean, the regular ones do as well, just not as much. I don't think I've ever felt pressured to use items much in main series Pokemon, except Same. when challenging myself. Especially with finite amounts of money, it really makes you not want to use items. Yeah. And then by the time you have pretty easy money, that's when the games start to get kind of easy and you don't need to. Yeah. Right. That is, if you just haven't been leveling up all of your Pokemon and just been boosting one. Yeah!
But even then, you could just do the bait and switch to get the EXP. Let's let's yeah. not forget that these are like games designed for the lowest common denominator child who's just sitting there. Like yeah. like when I was young, I was I was a third gen kid. I played Saf or like Sapphire slash Ruby, and I got all the way to I think one of the last and the second to last or the last gym before the Elite Four with just my Swampert and a Breloom. Like, I, I didn't... I didn't spread out my EXP share. I just... I didn't. So, so it's I like, have... they're they're operating on... Is a kid... Kid like that get, is gonna... Are they gonna be playing that game? We yeah. Have is, that. It, is it kid accessible is what they have in their heads? I yeah. guess that's fair. Abby. Yes? Uh, I want to highlight the fact that it says slowed movement. Slowed movement in this game is the most overpowered thing because it's not just the speed stat, it is it goes half as often. Oh. It's so literally you get the half the Yeah. I might have to no longer be able to teleport. Uh I feel like disables Action Economy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, action economy is always powerful. In a game like XCOM, if you have the ability to do something, okay. then do something again, it is broken. It is yeah. also broken in this game. Yeah. I go bear. <laughs> yeah. I love playing Rogue in Dungeon and Dragon. Mm hmm. Yeah, so I'm wondering. Well, Attract puts Affliction on them, which gives them a chance to not hit. Disable makes it so it. we go twice. So, like, it makes it so their rare move. It feels like attract and disable in a boss battle, very powerful. We make uh, it so they also wouldn't bosses not be or wouldn't bosses be immune to like certain special effects then? Nope, not in this uh, game. They are nope. in. They added stuff in later games to make the boss battles harder, but bosses are afflicted by normal statuses in this game. Um, I don't know when they added uh, immunities, but it's not here. Uh, Indeed, you can delete the final boss like nothing. If if I may throw in my final my, my two cents, uh, disable seems like it's better because it doesn't have the restriction on it that the target needs to be opposite gender from you. I don't think attract true. works on that though. Like attract doesn't care for gender at this in this it, game. It, oh, it, this it, move yeah. only affects enemies that are opposite gender. Oh, okay. It does. Yeah. I'm forgetting how to attract people. <laughs> No, no more, no more Abby seduction. This is it, probably damn. the best. It's I fine. I've learned so how to break your back him. instead. Okay. So and you, now, you fell in love with Dwayne the Rock Johnson, and that was your only love. Knees. By the way, um, just just as a side note, the most powerful status, in my opinion, in this game isn't isn't even double speed. It's um smoke screen. Smoke screen is yes. so stupid. Yes. Stupid it is so in this stupid. Game. Uh, it it inflicts the whiffer status. Uh, it there there is no accurate. I mean there is accuracy, but they don't have accuracy down. What they replaced it with is a status called whiffer, and it causes all moves to automatically fail with anything inflicted with it. <laughs> It's so like, they have, it's so they have this wacky situation where everyone just misses you. It is incredibly stupid, but it's so useful. And also, Stan's also great. Yes. Huh. He's probably to the highest ability and can, well, can, can't do anything. Spinner. If Abby isn't uh, doing the, the post game, could we just talk about the level one hundred, the uh, level one dungeons? Not yet. I mean, I do want to do this game and see what comes after it. Yeah. It so like if it's we can get the post game to work, I'm pretty sure she's more than willing to do the post game. It's just more about getting it to work with the save file. Yeah, right. I was going to say like yeah. you want to do all the story. But so we probably should not be talking about the post-game story dungeons at the very least. Yeah. I I bit a bird. 
I leveled up. I'll do better now. Guess I made a bird. Uh-huh. Get back here, puppy! No! There's Someone murder to be done. Voice line, please. Somebody clip that. Thanks. <laughs> Damn. You guys are not hitting each other. I'm just going to throw rocks at the dude. Hey, it's the Metapod <laughs> Harden versus Hard battle. Uh-huh. <laughs> You're countering. The other one is just standing there menacingly focusing. Do you have our Toma set to be aggressive right now? Because yes. Really going out for the murder. <laughs> I am going... angry, puppy. He's a mean little pup. Really upset he got de-evolved, I see. I want to bite things. No. Since they have the move. Yum, 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 yum. Our Tomas is going to start pointing uh, handheld lasers at helicopters and planes. Oh, God. Just wait till I get Force Palm. Are you going to punch it? Drought and Reviver. Ooh, Reviver. Reviver is the most oh. powerful item in this game. Yes. He's hoping you to find out why. Ah, uh, this is peak Mount Bristle. Uh-oh. It seems like a dead end. Excuse me, Mr. Dwowsy. Where's my lost item? Could you show me where the item is now? Sorry, kiddo. <laughs> Your lost item? It's not here, that's for sure. Huh? Big Bubba's following us, right? You coming soon? Nope. Your big brother's not coming. <laughs> I'll let you in on a little secret. This was all a trick. This is where the meme comes from! I deceived you. Huh? But let's not dwell on that. There's a little favor I need to ask. See that hole behind you? Well, there's a rumor that there's a trove of th thief treasure inside there. But as you can see, I'm too big to squirm my way through that hole. And that's where you come in. Don't worry, just do as I say. Do that. Then I'll help you get back out of there. But, but... Go on. Get going. Go into that hole, and don't forget to bring back the treasure. I, I want my big brother! Hey! Stop that! Sheesh. I said that I'll take you home when we are done. If you keep being difficult, it will mean big trouble for you. Uh, help! Stop right there! They're blue and yellow. We're blue and yellow. We won't let you do that. Drowsy, you bully. <laughs> How did you find this place? We are Team Renaissance. Resonance, not Renaissance. <laughs> Renaissance. I want to go to the Renaissance, Abby. I, we're not going to the Renaissance. I mean, actually, the PMD tech seems to be about Renaissance era tech. We are Team Resonance, an exploration team. No criminal can escape us. I'm terrible at reading. I'm sorry. Unless you're unless you're a ghost, at which point we're kind of screwed. If you're gonna fuck up, it might as well be the first time you pronounce it. <laughs> exploration <laughs> team. I don't know why I read it that way. It was... You came to apprehend. Huh? Are you trembling? Aha! Uh -huh. I figured it out. You say you're on an exploration team, but you're total rookies. Uh. <laughs> That's right, I'm a wanted Pokémon with a bounty on my head. But can you two do the job? 
With a knife? Can you confront this outlaw and bring him to justice? Uh, y yes, we can. Yes, we can. We'd never lose to a bad guy like you. <laughs> I've just been chased by all sorts of exploration teams in my day. But never a sorrier looking bunch than you two. Uh. Bitch. This should be a laugh. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Really hitting him where that hurts. <laughs> bitch. He should be on our team. Quietest little bitch. <laughs> Let's see if you can take me down. The fact it was so subtle. <laughs> Show me what you've got. I didn't realize when my my mic was on when I said it. <laughs> oh my god! It's funny, you're just like whispering it under your breath, like <laughs> just just <laughs> talk. That wasn't even me that said it. Uh, oh, that was so good. Anyway, have a rock. Don't get worry, wrecked, I'll take one line to get wrecked. Oh my god, kid, get back! <laughs> it's super effective against me. You did make him aggressive. Avoid the first hit. Please. I already took it! Please! You're going to die! Oh, too late. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, don't act dumb. Right. Yeah, we're... Don't you have orange berries? Oh, this is gonna be brutal. Uh, yeah, no, uh... Can I throw the, uh, uh, there's the blowback orb. That's gonna send him flying, right? Um, yeah. you use orbs. Okay, if I you use it... To, you you need to stand next to him, otherwise you're gonna... Because it, it happens in front of you, I believe, for the blowback orb. Check his okay. info, I think it should say. Okay, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna take the hit. Okay, yeah. so this would knock him back. Yeah. A mysterious- Ooh. Oh yeah, that's right, you can't use him during boss fights. Oh. We paralyzed each other from- <laughs> Synchronized- he disabled... <laughs> he disabled me, so Synchronize got us. Oh boy, isn't that unfortunate for you? Anyway, uh... I still didn't want heal. Now well, it's a staring contest. For him? Wait. It's literally like that gif of the Eevee and the Riolu dancing. Artomas, you need the healing more than I do. Not very effective. Still took 23, though. Oh my god. No. Yeah. You should. Really I fell asleep! Back no, I'm finally on the floor! You do have sleeping sprites, just not back home. I can't get out yeah, of it! The, the sleeping in your bed sprite is a You should probably switch Artemis to Let's Go Together. Yeah. I think the blast seat might be a good idea. A blast seat would work. Um, if you want Artemis to help, you really gotta take a step back one tile. Just gonna. Hey, uh. Oh yeah. What about save states? Yeah. Uh, I mean, if I hold on to this, will it automatically activate? No, it's it, it, in your bag. It's it's in your bag. Just... Oh, as it's long as it's your... in the bag. Yeah, yeah, you can have like ten of them in a bag, and they'll all work. Oh, okay. Yeah, they're uh, not a hell item. Okay. Well, let's see if. Okay, Swift will be not very effective because Psychic on Psychic has resistance. Uh, or no, 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 I'm talking, um, confusion. confusion, right? I'm just seeing if confusion, confusion has less power than swift, huh? It's not going to yeah, get but stabbed, but I don't stab, know. If, yeah. I don't know. If, well, stab and not very effective. Feel like they're going to cancel each other out. This is fair. Again, please, Artomas, bite him harder. He had four warrants, so... Ugh. Again. 
Okay, all right, a 15 with confusion. Oh, they got yes. Oh, I hit him hard. Oh, thank you. Thank you for the shout out, Beeb. Beeb. We came to rescue you. Are you all right? You're not hurt, are you? I'm hurt. <laughs> Don't worry about you. <laughs> I, I'm okay. Great. What a relief. Your big brother is waiting. Let's go home. Uh-huh. Okay. 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 Uh, and I would have gotten away with it too if you were for you meddling kid. I am Magnazone, the primary officer in this region. Z Z Z thanks to you. We have been able to arrest a, a wanted outlaw. Z oh, nice. Z we owe you great thanks for your cooperation. Z Z we will send the reward to your guild. Thank you again. Z Z now come with us. Z Z and your little dog, too. Aww. I'm sorry. Your new just... roommate will love you. Uh. Shazimu will. Yeah. Meryl! That was not push to talk, but I guess they heard you anyway. Through my mic. That's perfect. That's perfect. <laughs> it worked out either way. Meryl! It was so scary! You okay, Zumwell? Are you hurt? He's fine. The little guy hasn't been harmed in any way. Except emotionally. Really? Except emotionally, yeah. He yeah. has drama. Trauma. Hard for life. But I, don't know, I, gotta go. I gotta go. Oh, all right. Back. You have a good yeah. one, Tank. Take care. Bye bye. Oh, it's Zoom Wheel. Goodbye. It's Zoom Wheels. I'm glad you kids are happy. You did all of this for us. It at home is nappy. Aww. We won't ever forget what you did for us. Thank you so much. Oh, I do well, you too. Yup. Thank you uh, very much. Thank you for rescuing me. Really? <laughs> really, thank you. Oh. How oh, nice. The Exploration Team Federation has sent a message. Bag. Abby's team was rewarded with an enlarged treasure bag. Enlarged. You can now carry more items than before. Excuse me. Rewind. You, you can now carry more items than you could before. Expand. Wait. There's one more message. Yay. The special episode, Bidoof's Wish, has been unlocked. To play, to play a special episode, select it from the episode list in the top menu. And, and that's the part where you want to be able to save. Ah, uh, I see. If you'd like to play the special episode, save your adventure progress and return to the top menu. Ah, uh, we be big, big now. as well. Oh. Yes. Something Large for next time, I guess. Yeah, something for next time. I'm the game. Uh-huh. No, I don't even me. remember how to do this voice. <laughs> I've gotten the bounty from Officer Magnazone for the Captured Outlaw. Well done, you two. Ah. Here's your share for the job. It's yours to keep. Please be more than $200. Oh, okay. That's wait, that's our share? 
Uh, However... No. Oh... <laughs> I gotta it's have no more than 200. Uh, I okay. see. The constant reminder of yeah. capitalism. Capitalism was always there. What? Yeah, this the, is all the, we get? Yeah. The, the, the guild gets a 90% split for some reason. Listen to you, little cut. shit. They're all that hard work. <laughs> but of course. I heard it's all about shit, the training. Way. And we expect just as much effort tomorrow! Hehehe! <laughs> I believe robbery. A little bit, yeah. Oh, hey kids, can uh. you say exploitation? Ooh! <laughs> and people wonder why our generation is, you know, anti capitalism. Uh, right? This is what we grew up <laughs> with. We got, got wage theft from day one. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> grew up with it integral part of our childhood. I'd be happy if our share with the reward was just a little bigger. I can at least make the bottom screen a little bigger for the stream. But that's all right. You managed to rescue Azrael. That's all thanks to you, Abby. Because you had that dream, Abby. It, it's my powers. We learned about Azrael's trouble in advance. It is true. I can explain it. It's called my powers. But uh, the first shout I heard from Azrael. Help! And that dream I had. If you keep being difficult, it will mean big trouble for you. Help! <laughs> Both of those events. Took place with a metal pipe getting bashed against my skull. Help! <laughs> they took place in the future. Why was I able to see something like I know why I was able to see something like that. I'm a psychic. Remember, you're not normally an Abra at this point. Yeah, but still. What was that dream about? Not supposed to have future sight for another like thirty oh. levels. Yeah, that's actually that's actually the sound effect it plays when you get hungry in dungeons as well. Oh, boop boop. boop. Very uh, cute. My stomach growled. Uh. <laughs> Your stomach growled too, Abby. Yeah, I'm thinking about Taco Bell. Ah, uh, we must have worked up a big appetite for tacos. Yeah. We were so focused on rescu rescuing Azrael, I didn't notice at all. But now I'm even hungrier! Ah, now I'm a delicious Baja Blast! Ah, refreshing! <laughs> Come on, let's go get Taco Bell, Abby! Alright, goodbye! Go to Taco Bell, late run! It's over. <laughs> I'm welcome well, well, for the sound effect, by the yeah. way. All, all of the times I've played this game, and I just now realized that. Wigglytuff is just juggling an apple on their head. Yep. Yeah. Mm. That's all he does. Never eats it. Never eats it. He doesn't need to eat. Wow, the lightning's intense. Yeah, you should probably move away from the window steel type. But I love. I'm not steel type yet. I love the rain. Uh huh. Looks like it's a really stormy tonight. It was a dark and stormy. Hold on. You know the night. Before we met, Abby? It was storming that night. Well, yeah, weather works like that. I found you out cold on the beach the day after that stormy night. Uh-huh. Well, do you remember anything about being out cold on that beach? Uh... Can you remember anything at all? Uh... I wonder... Huh... There was a storm, but how did I end up unconscious here? No, I can't remember a thing. Guess it won't be that easy. But that's alright. Just try remembering a little at a time. You have to get up early again tomorrow. Let's get some sleep. Try not to run all night again, please. I can't guarantee that. Damn it. 
Not until we see if I can modify the ROM and make that fix. Uh, listen, Abby, you you really need to calm down on this exercise routine. It's calisthenics. Look, every morning you do a little bit of running, you, you know, you keep yourself toned and fit. Are you still awake, Abby? No, I'd like doing this in my sleep. I mean, that that's actually typical for you if you look at all your... Anyway, I've been thinking over since it happened. Uh-huh. That strange dream you had, Abby. Uh-huh. Maybe it has to do with you personally, Abby. Maybe it's my type. Huh? That's just the feeling I get. I sure don't know of any other Abra who dreams about the future. <laughs> you know... Maybe you don't know a lot of Abra. I might I'll be not. real. Maybe I'm the only Abra you know. They did say they, they did were say quite they rare. Were common. Yeah. Yeah. I've never heard of a, po a human suddenly turning into a Pokemon either. That's why I think those two events are connected. Really now? I can't help feeling that way. I might be a dumb fighting type, though. Uh, you're not dumb. You have at least two IQ gummies inside you. Hell yeah. Key to unlocking my memory. Was it in that dream? But even if it were true, how does it relate to anything else? I have no way of knowing what you were like as a human, Abby. But I think you must have been a good person. I try. After all, Abby, it was your dream that helped us catch that bad Pokemon. Ah. Oh. Bad Pokemon. Huh. Oh, that reminds me of what Chadot said. That the growing number of bad Pokemon has been has caused time to go out of whack. You know? Time is getting messed up, bit by bit, all over the world. No one seems to know why. But everyone believes that the time gears are somehow involved. What? Huh? Time Gears? They yes, I do know the Kadabra story. Yeah. They, they say Time Gears are hidden in secret places around the world. Like in a forest? Or at a lake in an underground cavern? I've even heard that there's one hidden uh, in an altar inside of a uh, volcano. Can't talk right now. At the center of such places is what's known as a time gear. Time gears serve as a very important function. To be worn by all the pokey furs at the convention. <laughs> yes. Yes. Correct. Each one protects time and keeps time flowing properly in its own region. Oh. Oh, who's that guy? But what happens if a region loses its time gear? I don't really know the answer to that question. There it goes! But, my guess is that if a time gear is removed from a region, the flow of time in that region would probably stop, too. That's why everyone makes sure to never disturb the time gears. Everyone has long been certain that some kind of disaster would strike. So, everyone stays away from the Time Gears and doesn't tamper with them. Even the most hardened criminal Pokemon know to avoid messing with them. Do my eyes deceive me? Could it be? Yes! It is! <laughs> I finally found it! A Time Gear! Uh, but... This is only the first of many. 
Oh no, he's hot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I think this is a good point to put a pin in it. This is the best point. I'm going to save the save state. And I think at this point, I'm going to call the state time gear. We're going to save it. And I think this is a good point for us to call it. But I want to thank all the wonderful voice actors who joined us today. And absolutely. We, I want to try to make this a Sunday thing. If everyone's able to uh, join in reoccurring Sundays. I can try. Uh, I I can make an effort. I cannot. I also know Dang next it. week is kind of a Christmas Eve, and then after that, I'm gone for Zeldathon for a couple weekends, so it might be a bit before we come back. I don't know yeah. if everyone's going to be available on Christmas Eve, and I don't want to take people away from their Christmas Eves. Fair. But mm. I want to thank thank you all for being here. Thank you all for being fantastic. We have a ton of viewers. You all are blowing my normal numbers out of the water, so it's really appreciated. Thank you all Everybody's for coming. Excited. Thank you for inviting us. Yeah. Agreed. Well, don't be afraid to invite your friends and come on by and follow the channel and all that good stuff. But we're going to go give a raid to somebody who's drawing Abby right now. Mm. BB's mm. Art Boutique. It, I commissioned them during MFF to draw a wonderful Abby in a scrungly style. And that's what they're doing right now. And I think they're just about to be done. So we're going to go give them a raid. But thank you all for being here. Thank you all for being fantastic. I'm going to head out and probably get some food because I'm very hungry. Bye. Thank you all for being fantastic. Yep, yep. All right. Lois Abra. Bye. Yeah, Lois Abra. When did that become a thing? Lois Abra? Yeah. I don't worry about it. Man. Family <laughs> God. But anyway, thank, thank you all for later. being here. Thank you. I, I, I'm not. Uh, there it is. I'm oh my god. god. <laughs> thank you, everybody. You have to do it. Yeah. But anyway, thank you all for being here. Thank you for being fantastic. Make sure you follow all that good stuff. And if you're interested in joining us as a VA in the future, hit me up on Discord. But thank you also, all for being wonderful. Also, so y'all know, we plan to do a KH again soon. So keep in tune for that. Yeah, go, yeah, go check we'll out re- our we'll, Yeah, go check out my boyfriend. Anyway. Yeah. Y'all stay fantastic. Thank you all for being here and uh, enjoy the rest of your Sunday. Bye. Bye bye. 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 Oh my god. <laughs> Great noise, Ben. Uh, beautiful. <laughs> Amazing. Dude, I can't wait till uh, someone brings up the pop's voice. <laughs> oh, goodness. Aw, oh, thank you all for joining. Yeah. Man. Yeah, that was great. It was yeah. great. Yeah. <laughs> Do I have I was literally about to send Thank this to you. Me. <laughs> Thanks for having us. I cursed you. You're floating oh. pizza. You guys. I was literally, literally <sighs> seconds away from sending this to you here. Alright. Yeah, I'm gonna oh, head out and get some food, but y'all have a wonderful time and uh yeah. Bye. Bye. Wonderful. <laughs> Take care. Pizza. Goodbye. Wee boy. Bye. Wee boy. Bye. <laughs> oh my god. What is that thing? Thanks, Abra. Let me get your shoddy. Yeah. Yeah.